Quiet. Find the number of moles containing 0.2 grams of sodium hydrogen carbonate. Number of moles. So we are looking for amount of substance, or what you call the small n. So my mass is 0.2 grams. I have to look for my molar mass of sodium hydrogen carbonate. Sodium is 23, hydrogen is 1, carbon is 12, oxygen is 16, and I pH 6 3 times. Compute. 84 gram per mole. This is the molar mass. Find the number of moles. So, number of moles, small n, question mark. Now, there is a relationship between mass and molar mass. So, number of moles. It was mass over molar mass. So, and it's the same as you saying this. I hope you know that. Now, what is the mass? 0 0.2 grams. The molar mass is 84 gram per mole. You see that? Yes, and this goes over volume there. Yeah. So, this is what you are getting. When you put a finger and you get standard forms of the calculator, don't worry, it's easy. Good. Now you see, this against the reflect of the mole. But the mole is under the partition sign line. Right? So when it goes up, it becomes positive. Are you okay? No wonder amount of substance is still what? Moles. Now hold on, hold on. Now what if you are asked to determine the gram from this same question, the mass? What will you do? So maybe you can have a next question like this. What is the mass of 2.3? This mole of sodium hydrogen carbonate. So they will give you this. So what is the mass of this? You understand? Okay. So my molar mass is already known. We know it right. So I put number of moles equals mass over what? Molar mass. So mass is what? Number of moles by what? Molar mass. The number of moles is 2.83 times 10 to the power of the Agree? And the molar mass is what? 84. Now, what is the mass? You get 0 0.2 what, grams. Are you okay? So, they can ask you to find the mass from the same thing. The same formula that you're going to use. Are you okay? Just like list your parameters out and know what to do. 